What is going on, people? It is your boy, Daddy Mac, and welcome back to a brand new Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. Today, we are against Fall Inks Propaganda. He reached out to me on Instagram. I almost said Twitter. He reached out to me on Instagram. His Instagram link is going to be in the description down below, so be sure that you guys check out his Instagram. Give him a follow. Uh, Fall Links is actually bringing a really cool team. Just got to make sure that my voice is... As uh, one time I kind of messed it up. So Fallings is bringing a cool team overall. Lunala is a little bit concerning. Um, he, he has the Italian. He has the Cinderace. I thought he was going to bring the Rillaboom. Now, he has a Dracovish. We're both running Dracovish. The Cloister is a little bit concerning if it has Water Absorb. And Malamar can be a little threatening with the Contrary ability there. So looking at his team... Right off the bat, what I'm going to do is start off Galvantula in case he wants to start off with the Cloister. Try, try to threaten that. Cloister's special defense is not as high as its physical defense. So, <clears throat> that's why we're going to be running, or that's why we're going to be bringing Galvantula for the first, uh, as the first Pokemon. Really quick, before I click begin, make sure you guys leave a like on this video. I'm excited to battle Falinx, to be honest with you guys. I've actually been wanting to battle him for a little a little while now just a little scared to ask but also comment down below on who the mvp of this battle is going to be either falling side or my side and who we're going for if you guys follow falling so i'm really excited falling let's have a good battle last but not least subscribe to my channel for more pokemon sword and shield wi-fi battles and i just as i predicted he's bringing out that cloister so looking pretty good for me what I'm going to do here is go for the Thunderbolt right off the bat because the last thing I want this thing to do is hit me with a, a Shell Smash. Okay, so we knock it out. Beautiful knockout. Couldn't ask for a better start to this battle. What I was thinking also is for the team builders in Espanol. The Cinder Race. I like that. He's probably going to hit me with the Pyro Ball. I'm going to take the opportunity to go for a Sticky Web. Anyways, what I was thinking is I really want to start doing live team builders, but I don't know how you guys would feel about it rather than just showing my team what, what abilities, moves, and what's or not they have. I kind of want to do that live, what my thought process is when it comes to team building. I don't want to do that for the Yoshifu team that's coming up after the DLC comes in. Uh, well, by the time you guys are watching this video, DLC already came in, um, but I forgot what I was going to say. I lost my train of thought. I don't think I outspeed the Cinderace, but I do think Cloist. No, no, no. I actually. I feel like Galvantula is still valuable to me, but I think it's time to let him go down. So I'm going to go ahead and Thunderbolt here. Iron Head. Libero. Is it Libero or Libero? I'm not sure with any soccer terms, to be honest with you guys. All right, Galvantula goes down as expected. Okay. So, what is he going to do now? I kind of want to incinderate. Or, incinderate? <laughs> what is an incinderate? I'm going to incinderate here just to get that intimidate off. And he's probably going to go for the fighting type move. He's going to go for the fighting type move. So, what I'm going to do here... I kind of want to... I don't even know what I want to do, to be honest. I kind of want to wishy-washy to threaten it with the... With the hydro pump. Or even the Scald, because Cinderace would not appreciate the Scald. So he's probably going to go for the Fighting Time move. I'm going to go into Wishy Washy. So Wishy Wishy Washy Washy. I don't even know what I'm saying at the time, to be honest. Alright. So we got Schooling Wishy Washy, who forms a school. Gunk Shot. I was not expecting that. Now Poison type. Hopefully it doesn't do it. It does a lot of damage. That's not what I was hoping for. Okay, that's all right. So what I'm gonna do is try. I should have clicked Scald. I said Scald was my original plan. I don't know why I didn't go through with it. All right, Wishy Washy gonna take me down, and now Wishy Washy is kind of worthless to me. And you get the poison. Touche, Falling. Touche. That's some life orb right there. Hydro Pump. Okay, I was gonna be a little salty by Mist. Probably gonna knock out the Cinderace though. Yeah, knocks it out. That's what I wanted. Poison is going to rack up slowly but surely. I think it's time to let Wishy Washy... Oh, he's going to go down anyways. Alright, so we're both starting from scratch again. Probably Malamar is going to come out. Or even the Lunala. I'm going to go 
Incineroar. Snipe the Italian. That's a really good play by you. That's a really good play. Um, what is my next move? Snipe the Italian. Probably gonna go for the water type attack, obviously. Obviously, and now. What I'm gonna do is go into the Dracovish. Italian was probably still outspeed me. But I don't know if I should hit it with a vicious rent or focus it. You're gonna try to crit you're gonna try to crit me. Really good read right there. Really good read predicting the switch. Um Psychic Fangs or Crutch. The reason I'm going for those instead of uh, maybe Dragon Rush is stronger. So 80 times what is it? 0.30? I don't remember. I, I think Crunch is better. I think Crunch is the better move, though. No, it's Psychic Fangs because it has a little bit of a uh, little bit of a higher. Oh, you're Dynamaxing, big boy, big boy, uh, Italian. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> you you kind of have me scared right now, Phalanx. I really hope you're watching this. Big boy, Italian. That was a cool cry. I wonder if it's uh, if it's Gigantamax form will have the same cry. I probably outspeed. I outspeed. There was no need for that. Max Airstream, you're gonna out. You're, you're not gonna out. Obviously, gonna outspeed the rest of my team. Oh boy, this isn't. It's a crit expected, and you get your speed up. Okay, I kind of want to Dynamax myself now. I'm not gonna lie. Kind of want to. I have three Pokemon left. He has four. And he still has the, the Lunala in the back. Alright, I'm gonna go Sail Valley here. It's time for a Dynamax. Try to lower this thing's speed because of the max strike. Probably should have also gone. I'm, I'm scared of the critical hit ratio. That's what I'm afraid of. I, I'm scared of the critical hits ratio being high enough to crit, to crit me again. I'm gonna Dynamax my Sail Valley here. Try to lower this thing's speed by one. And hopefully one shot it, even though that's asking for a little too much. I love Sil Valley. Sil Valley is one of my favorite Pokemon. Okay. Max Geyser. That's not what I was wanting, to be honest. It's a crit! I know it. I know it's a crit. It's a crit. It's an Inteleon sweep. I'm a little salty. I'm a little bit salty. Wow. I had a really good feeling that was a crit. I think every every hit now, every attack he hits me with now is a crit. Wow, I'm getting molly whopped. Okay, um I have nothing to be honest. I, I really don't have anything. I'm gonna sucker punch here. It's my best best move. <laughs> Lost some HP, even though that doesn't do a lot. And I'm going down to a Max Geyser. It's a critical hit. I, it's in the rain. And I'm super effective. So that's like times times four. Times, let's say times six or eight because of the critical hit. I don't know my values too much. It's over, guys. It is over. Falling's just messaged me. Water go whoosh. <laughs> Sniper crits are the best, Falinx. It's done. It's over for me. I I really, you know, I have no words. I really have no words. I'm gonna get you on a rematch. Best believe I'm gonna get you on a rematch. This was a really fun battle. It, it was a quick battle at that, but it was really fun. I'm not Choice Scarf, so you can just click the, the uh, snipe shot. And it's gonna knock me out. Oh my goodness. Falinx, you're awesome. You're awesome. <laughs> okay. Snipe shot, gonna knock me out. And it's done. He just incinerated my incineroar. No pun it no pun intended. It's a critical hit in the rain. I could I really couldn't have done anything because you, you you just beat me fair and square. You you straight up molly me. I have no words, Falling. That was an awesome team. That was probably the best team I battled ever. Um, I'll take your lead, your lead card because it's it's pretty cool. But 
there you have it. A really quick Wi-Fi battle, and I just got molly -whopped. I, I really have no words. Make sure you guys leave a like on this video. Comment down below on who the MVP was on my team and Falling's team. I think Falling's your... Your, uh, what should I say? MVP, your most valuable Pokemon was that Snipe Shot Inteleon. Also, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battles. Falling's, I'm coming for you next time. I'll see you guys next time.